Well, this morning, folks, we're up very early. Half five, the first Sunday in August. Hair bells and all their glory, eh? Don't feel like I've been to bed. We're in the pretty village of Mackle. <laughs> We're here for a specific reason. I didn't bring a bag. I put my phone in me. I thought it would stay at the top. It fell down my leg. <laughs> so the reason we're here is, on this particular day, at this particular time, the video, go on. Apparently, it's, it's a healing well, so when you come to this well, at the sunrise on the 1st August, and you bless yourself with the water, or drink the water, or put it wherever it is that on yourself is not well, you get healed. We're all for that. Oh, and the, the Coast Guard's here in case you fall in, look. <laughs> <laughs> the lad's new. Hello. <laughs> Kelly's on the move. Better... <laughs> We're hoping for a nice sunrise, but maybe. And although Carla said it's the first Sunday, on some places it's the second Sunday. So just in case Bill tried to put us right again. Also, if they say it's the second Sunday in August or Easter Day are the Easter days day. to get yourself healed, yes. Right. And these saints came from Scotland, I believe. <coughs> so do we know when this well was established? Yes. Eight, 188, hang on, 1874, I think it was. 74 or 64, wasn't it? Something like that, yeah. Used to be a seat there. Like a horseshoe seat. Um, I, I think it's something like that. And do you know what? There's something similar that was in Peel. Um, I'm going to show you, actually. I'll show you later. But didn't you say there was something... St. Patrick's mackled or something. Oh, look at the sun. I told you we'd come out. my phone. I told you, we have no faith. The spirits will look after us, you know. Don't want it to happen. Yeah, so there's one, there is one, um, <coughs> you know, at the end of Peel, uh, you know that cafe that we go to, yeah. Bowling Green? It, at the end of there, there's a well in the wall that's been filled in. Oh, the old swimming pool end? Yeah, have you oh, ever seen it? No, no. no oh, no. I, well, with my stone eye one day, I looked up and noticed something that wasn't really was right. Posted. It looked different. Went up and read it, and yeah, there used to be a well there. The horses used to come up and drink. Apparently, <clears throat> nice fishing boat here as well. <coughs> Get yourself some Mackey. Now, if Go you're coming then. down here, it's a bit steep, and this time it's not slippery. Just be aware, though, that you're right at the edge of the cliff. Mm. And if, like me, you suffer from vertigo, oh, shh. Okay. makes your testicles tingle. Mine aren't tingling. Well, we don't know about that, do we? <laughs> Talking of testicles tingling. Gay Pride weekend comes up soon. Ray's going there and I'm going to the Royal Show. <clears throat> so, you can see the path is fenced. And we're nearly there. Oh, doggies. Not a very long walk.
Carl's got a bottle to collect the uh, water for a health given drink. It looks like a sample bottle, but yeah. it really isn't. <laughs> So are you going to drink it then, Ray? Well, I was wondering, do we make a cup of tea with it? Um, Still be same same things, wouldn't it? Are well, you scared? Well, I don't want to live on the edge. This is close enough to the edge for oh, me. The dogs have just had a drink, so get in there. <laughs> Which one peed in it this time? <laughs> do you know what? It's the clearest I've ever seen it. That's lovely. Is it? Yeah. I've never been this close. They've knocked it back, they must have done. It's been cleaned out from since the last, it's been trimmed around it. Dave, I wonder if um, the folks are going to be here today then. I reckon so. Because it is going to be quite popular. It's good that we got here early. Absolutely. We might have, have to pay a pound or something. There'll be no water left by the time we get to that. <laughs> so Carl and I was going to dip the bottle, dip the bottle, dip the bottle in the water. What does she look like, Carla? Hang on, let me put it up to the light. Just a little bit of grass in it, but who doesn't like a bit of grass? We're going to drink it out of the bottle. I'll drink a little bit, yeah. Go on then. That grass is lovely. Do you think that tastes really nice? Does it? Yeah. Um, there was a story about a woman that was on a boat from Liverpool to Ramsey, donkeys years ago, obviously. And she said to one of the people on the ship, uh, where's St. Mackle's well? I think that's what they called it back then. Some will know, it doesn't matter. Something like that, St. Mackle's well. And uh, they, they were pointing it, going, oh, it's over there yonder. Can you see it? And she went, no, I can't make it out. She says, I, I believe that it's a healing well and I'm, I'm coming this way because I want to heal my eyes. And I've been told if I go there and clean my eyes into the well, I will be able to see properly again. Anyway, she goes on, does her thing, gets back on the boat and then speaks to one of the guys and says, was it you that I was speaking to? And he says, yes, it was actually. She goes, ah, right. Well, I can see the well clearly now, as you can see it. I clean my eyes and I'm cured. Mm. Oh, funny, isn't it? Mm. You're looking gorgeous. Hang on. Slow down now. Uh, as Carl has took a drink from the bottle, it's only fair I do as well. So if we both snuff it, you'll know what's caused it and the healingness has disappeared. It is clear and it does look like it's been cleaned out. That's rather nice water, it's nice, isn't, isn't it? It's nice, isn't it? That yeah. is nice. I could go with that girl. Yeah, I'm going to take the rest and stick it on some nice plants at home or something. Make them grow lovely. I bathe in it. I don't know. Did you bring those water bottles that you have for up here at your shack? Yeah. We'll fill them all up. I have managed six gallons of healing water. <laughs> I only live till my 160. Oh, God, no. <laughs> See, folks, I grew up with. There she is. <laughs> Give us a wave, boat. I <laughs> oh, don't then. You hey, he waved back. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say, do you remember that Only Fools and Horses episode? The one you were in? Shut up. Uncle Albert. Yeah. Don't walk so fast. Uh, <laughs> Sorry, uh, dear. Where he's on his way to um, Belgium and he gets lost with his old tram steamer. All oh, right. And he shouts to some oil field, hey, John, which way to Holland? And he says, that way. That's what they were telling us. <laughs> we, got, we got our son. I told you the spirits will look after us. Did I not say? They'll make sure it works for us. I'm like an old man. Hmm? You're like an old man, of course you do. I said you sound like an old man. 
and a bottle of water. I'm surprised how nice that is, though. Hello. It tastes totally different to tap water. Mm. You know, it's a very it's like slightly Even sweet. Even with the um, grass dirt in it. In it. Mm. But well, it's, look how clear it is. <gasps> it's mental, isn't it? Yeah. Just a few floaties at the bottom, but. Oh. <laughs> well, you've told me about that. A bit too many floaties for me, girl. <laughs> uh, hold on. Oh, me to hold it for you? No. I'm, I'm kind of trying to vision doing something, but it's not working. All right, go on. Speak. Okay, well, we've done what we set out to do this morning. Get here for sunrise. Unfortunately, the clouds mask the sunrise, but we got the Coast Guard oh, going past. Still got the nice sun though. We did. We the did. fisherman gave us a wave on his way to Belgium, where he's going. <laughs> the dogs are with us, the water was beautiful. And as usual in the Isle of Man, there's not a soul about just us two. Mm. Oh, other land. Hello, world. So I'm on your way to Belgium. And you're going to give me a morning kiss. Since I was so grumpy this morning, you the bell you, look at you. You, <laughs> you were grumpy this morning, I thought. I'll just keep away from the old bat. This is the bat. I'm glad we made the effort. I am actually, yeah. I am really glad. It's so worth it in the end. I was, get, I was getting grumpy because I'm like, we're going to miss the sunrise. It's the sunrise that makes it for me. Yeah. And the well wasn't going anywhere. It's, it's made it even more for me that someone's cleared it for us. Thank you very much, whoever did that. Yes, we do have to thank you, whoever cleared the well mm. out. And if you're going to come up here, <clears throat> you can thank yourselves for doing either today or next Sunday, depending on which items of history you read. And I don't know whether you're up at sunrise or is it just the day. I don't know. That's funny. Roxy's always hurting her front paw. She's just washed both of them in it. You done that, Rox? You clever girl. I love it that the fisherman waved back. No, I, I bet you that he heard us, you know. I bet he did too. Yeah. yeah so we were, it was quiet, isn't he? Didn't have his engine going at the I'd time. love to know the name of that boat. I bet I could find out. Right. I'm actually going to have another drink of this. All the stuff's floating to the bottom now, so. Well, if you think about it, if people came down here to uh, collect the water, they would be not worried about the bits in the bottom, would they? Do you know, if if that's all you had, that's bloody good. Exactly. There was nothing else to drink. <clears throat> it's really nice. And it's like being at the top of a hill that's probably got no pollutions in it. Mm. Very nice. Do you know, it, and it didn't take long to walk down. It seemed like forever last time, didn't it? Yeah, but too, quite often it's like when we do these walks. When you walk back, you think... Didn't take long, but they're going here. It took ages. Mm. Come on then, Roxy. Leave the water for somebody else, girl. You've done your feet. Come on, they'll be fine now. Let's go. So the dog has the runs, we have the runs. We just have to tell them, don't go near that well. We need, we need another toilet. <clears throat> don't often do this sort of walking away from a, um, a project, but... This is just too nice not to do today. So as you can just see in the foreground there, or in the background, I should say, Ramsey by the sea. Life might be okay sometimes, but oh. most of the time my sock's falling down in my shoe. Oh dear. <laughs> it's so annoying. Back to the style. Oh, woggy dogs. Oh, sorry, don't mind me. It's actually a kissing gate. Is it? That's how we're going then. <laughs> Let's see if I can do it. 